Stop. Hi, I'm Bill Hader, and thanks for joining me for day one of TCM's Friday Night Spook Fest of Scary Movies. For the rest of the night, we are going to be introduced to some mad scientists, some who want to bring to life new creations, others who want to rule the world. Up next, we have one of the most horrific films in our entire series, not necessarily about what it shows, but what it represents. It's Fritz Lang's 1933 epic, The Testament of Dr. Mabuse, a film Lang himself considered an allegory to Hitler's terroristic rise in Germany. The movie is a sequel to Lang's silent 1922 film, Dr. Mabuse the Gambler, which was based on a book by Norbert Jacques and turned into a screenplay by Lang's wife at the time, Thea von Harbo. In our film, The Criminal, Dr. Mabuse is a patient in a lunatic asylum, but his criminal activity has yet to cease. Somehow he's controlling the underworld from his cell. What makes this movie fascinating is the fact it was banned in Germany by the Minister of Propaganda, Joseph Goebbels, because the Nazi party was afraid that if they released a movie which depict a government overthrow, people might get inspired to do it. From 1933, here's a truly frightening film from director Fritz Lang, The Testament of Dr. Mabuse.